Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am Mystical Mermaid. They call me m, &M. Thank you for coming to my channel. If you would like to put the thumbs up, you can. If not, that's okay, too. All right, y'all. I want to go ahead with my disclaimer. I have to do this. This is not my entertainment. Let's get that clear. This is my life. This is my insight, my guidance, my opinions. I do not want any hate or negativity spread to anyone mentioned in this video because of something I have said. Now, I know that the folks are coming to help look for her and search for her. So I'm going to go ahead and see if there was anything new that I seen. Um, Dawn, man, there is so much energy around Dawn right now. I don't think he knows which way is up and down. Okay. Um, I do feel if he wasn't part of it, then he definitely has found out who was or what happened because there's some, there's something there. Okay. Um, I can't really be sure because I don't have any pictures of him um, to see his colors if I had the, a, like a very recent picture that would be awesome now Candace she's a bit harder to get okay not for myself but definitely um, as we get older we're able to see through substance and, and and pick that up you guys so basically she's literally so numb right now she's very under the influence but i do and like i can't help i see the worst and the best okay or the best and the worst and y'all get what i'm saying um i feel like she's starting to feel a little so she's trying to numb it even more if that makes sense um, I do feel some shame and defeat and just sadness, okay? I'm also seeing her talk to a brown-headed male. I'm not picking up which male this is. I do know it's brown-headed. Um, they're talking about choices her choices, but she's still undecided on what she's going to do. This is clearly about this situation. I do feel Dawn is home, but I do also know that he did get upset and leave, but I do feel he's back. But I'm seeing both of them being very disconnected to one another. At some point, I do see them hug. They're just very disconnected, discontent. Um, no one really knows what to say, I guess. I feel like they their intuition is telling them that time is here. Okay. I see the sheriff's energy. His colors are energetically really coming towards Candace. Okay. That leads me to believe that he definitely knows something or will learn something. Okay. But I also see that he knows things that he hasn't disclosed. All right. Now, let's talk about Hunter for a minute. Hunter is scared. Mama Bear is protecting him, though. I'm seeing that she did want him to leave and go out of state. But I don't think he was allowed to. It was stopped really suddenly. He feels trapped. He's, he feels scared. He's very confused on whether or not he should come forward because he's definitely hiding information. This is very clear. This one will break. 
if they interrogate him, he would break. All right. And I mentioned that several videos back. Now I'm going to say, Candace, if you happen to be watching this, I don't know if you do or not, but if you are, you have a message, okay? Whew, I'm seeing what's next for you. I actually fear. I do. I fear this outcome. Listen, Candace, it's going to be much harder if you do what it is I see that you're going to do. I'm seeing you panic. I'm seeing you cover up all your errors. But spirit is saying loud and clear. Stop. That's nonsense. It's time to do what's right. Candace, I'm telling you, if you don't heed that, I promise you, it's you're going to regret that. You need to be obedient. Or you will be humbled his way. And I do see it will be worse than de destruction, okay? All right. Now. Whew, about Summer's case. I'm seeing definitely additional evidences at the crime scene. So that leads me to believe those cans definitely, if they didn't get DNA off that, gosh, I hope they did. Um, I, I am seeing that crime scene is near their home. This crime is going to be solved by DNA testing or some sort of scientific method. I feel like cell phones are going to be cell phone records. I'm seeing some sort of surveillance or video as well. Now about the pregnancy. People commented and asked me how the pregnancy played a role. I can't tell you that. I don't know. I can only tell you what I'm shown. All I know is that it, it does. It shows up. I'm seeing a tan skinned man. I'm seeing a pregnancy. I'm seeing argument after argument. It gets heated. And I feel like these arguments is what's making her use more and more substances, which clearly has impaired her judgment. I'm also seeing, and I've mentioned this in several videos before, very clear that a neighbor or someone that lives close is hiding or withholding some very helpful information. I do feel this is a male. I feel it's something to do with that boat I am keep seeing. Now, Summer. I'm seeing Summer. She's definitely, it's closed in, trapped, small area. I want to say for sure it is the horse's. But it's, I'm seeing another animal. Like, I don't know if that's a cow or a mule, but definitely like a stable farm or something like that. Um, I'm also seeing a big building, or if this could be a house on the property. I'm seeing purple and red flowers all over this property. There's two men that work on this property. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. There's a light-haired one and a dark-haired one. The dark-haired one has a beard. I'm being shown that she's when she's being hidden, I feel the energy of a young male present, and I do sense it is age. It's like he is making a distraction or maybe the lookout while the other one did it. I wanted to ask, near 
those horses or wherever everybody's talking about? Does people have campfires? Does people camp out? Because I am saying this is somewhere where somebody makes campfires. It's very close to that. I am seeing she's going to be found. I see her lying in this wet place. She's not covered in water, but it's definitely all around her. Her head is probably to her ears. Okay. Um, seeing like these big leaves, um, like frog leaves. I don't know what those are called. Um, Y'all have done seeing insects and bugs all over. And I know y'all don't want to hear that part. But imagine how we feel. All right. I feel dogs or some sort of animal is going to pick up on a scent. I don't know why I feel like someone, and I, it's almost like a female, um, it doesn't have to be a female, but there's someone, I don't know if it's intuition or there's someone that thinks that the dog was picking up something and I think they're being rushed and they're like, no, let's just go this way. I pray they follow their intuition because this is going to be the moment that decides whether she's going to be found this weekend or not. And I do feel if this person decides to trust their intuition and trust that dog, it's a black dog. He's got brown around his mouth. He's got brown on his neck and he has brown a few places on like his paw and his leg. That will literally be if she's found or not. It's all determined on this person. If this person follows their intuition, I do feel she's going to be found. Um, <coughs> excuse me. I'm also seeing, I feel like she's definitely going to be found between 7, 21, through 820 but I feel it's the sooner I'm just kind of giving a time frame okay folks I feel like it's going to be this weekend if that person follows their intuition okay some important dates that they're showing me right now is January 11th through I'm going to say that week right there the week of January 11th and the week of March 21st okay um There's lots of crazy energy surrounding this weekend, okay? Whew. I pray that the authorities listen and consider wise counsel and search things they hear about. There's a big chance, like I said, she will be found this weekend. It's up to them if they're going to listen to their intuition. Dawn's energy this weekend, it's very flip-floppy because I'm seeing a lot of deceit and then I'm seeing lies as well as fulfillment. I mean, it makes sense, I guess, but I don't know. I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Now, Candace's energy this weekend as soon as I connect with it, I see that truth will be known. You guys, this overall weekend energy is looking really good. I feel a lot of victory and a lot of success. So instead of us all picking on one another and all of us putting one another down and being petty, Let's uplift this search in prayer, uplift one another in prayer, love one another, be kind to one another, pray.
pray for the return of this baby. Y'all, I appreciate you so much for watching my video. Till next time, I'll see you later.